Okay, I have tried several different celebrities hair care products. This line is by far. Honestly, I'm just at a loss for words and y'all gonna hear my mouth and so is she. Simply so, simply so. package but I know she's gonna get me on the next go around she has eight products as well as a edge brush tool but baby y'all know Rihanna is she's top tier Mama couldn't get over her. I got a few items and we're gonna try them today so we're gonna make this intro real short just want to tell you guys what we're doing and um we're gonna see if these products work 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 see if they work 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 they better really work 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 let's go Starting off with the Rich One Moisture Repair Shampoo, which is a 10 ounce. I have to say this bottle is very different. Most are plastic or silicone, but this is aluminum, which I think is dope. I also love the style of the top. It has a groovy detail to it, which makes a great aesthetic. And if you're a texture person, it's super satisfying to touch. I also like how on the back of the bottle, there are pictures with the QR code that you can scan, which will bring you directly to the website and instruct you how to use the product. A hydrating reparative shampoo that gently cleanses all hair types. No silicones, free of sulfates, detangling, and color safe. Containing amino acids and antioxidants to help repair split ends and reduce breakage. I started by saturating my hair fully with water. And upon applying the shampoo, I noticed immediate lather which I love it was very smooth and silky feeling with each motion secondly the smell was so nice if you like your hair to smell pretty like floral flowers and a dash of amber baby you want like this very very pleasant and when I tell you a little goes a long way I mean just that it was given bubble bath which lets me know I'll be able to hold on to this bottle for quite some time and I can definitely appreciate that because it's more on the high end I wanted to really give myself a nice wash to get the best experience and while I started off impressed as I began working on the shampoo all over my hair and down my hair shaft my hair started to feel hard almost like it was stripping the moisture just wasn't there which let me know that one wash was all that was needed but then again, I needed a good cleanse, so I won't count it out just yet. Let's see after I rinse. So I was hoping to get a different outcome after adding some water, but unfortunately, my hair did not feel moisturized at all. I will say my hair was super clean. It gave that squeaky clean effect, which I don't like. As someone with low porosity hair, I need all of the moisture because my hair lacks that. I also noticed that my hair felt a bit tangled and I wasn't sure why I didn't give more of a softer feel being that this is specifically for hydration. It felt so good going on but not so much coming out. Moving on to the Rich One Moisture Repair Conditioner. I absolutely love this color. Look at the bottle. It's beautiful. Again, this is a 10 ounce aluminum bottle, a hydrating conditioner that makes the hair softer, reduces breakage, and repairs split ends. I absolutely love how thick this conditioner was. I wasn't expecting it to be this thick, but the consistency was just like, I already knew what it was going to give. It smelled so good, like coconuts and floral, and it just had a really, really nice slip upon application, which eased your girl's mind because the shampoo, it, it just wasn't giving like it was supposed to give. By using this, I knew I was going to get some more moisture and my curls was going to come back to life. I can always tell when my hair likes a product when it just absorbs. Right into my strands, this conditioner got my hair back together, okay? And I always like to work in small sections to ensure I don't miss any areas. I will say I did not struggle to detangle my hair. My hair felt very nourished, super soft, and it was very moisturizing. So... I have no complaints about this conditioner. I really like the way it felt on my hair. Again, my hair does really well with thick products, like really heavy products. So I already knew that this was going to give, but baby, the way my hair felt as I was rinsing it out, it just felt like butter. And that's what I was waiting for. I was waiting just for that. And it gave that my hair felt soft. My hair was easy to detangle. It would just glide it right through. And I love the moisture that I got. And I love how my hair just felt so strengthen and nourish and just just healthy another thing i want to mention is after i fully rinsed out the conditioner baby that smell was still there okay the smell was given it's almost like a hair perfume and if you're not really into fragrance this may not be for you but i love when my hair smells so pretty 
after. Usually when you wash and condition your hair, the smell would be there like faint. But baby, no, it was in full effect. And I love that. I also love the shine that my hair had. Another thing I noticed is that I did not lose a lot of hair. I don't really lose a lot of hair anyway, but it was a minimal to no hair shed after using this conditioner. So now it's time to style and I will be using the Home Curl Curl Defining Cream. This is 11.5 ounce. The jar is so cute. Look, just look at the aesthetic. It just gives so pretty. I love the color of it. I also can appreciate that it's in a jar with a lid. That's not something that you see all the time. So I can appreciate that again, making it easy to just open and close and to just grab and go. Y'all already know when I saw the texture and the consistency, I already knew I was going to have fun with this. Let's get into the tea. This is a silicone-free gel cream that shapes, defines, and enhances curls in just one step. I've never heard of a gel cream, but I'm here for it. This is supposed to provide all-day touchable, crunch-free hold and give you that curl definition, hydrate, soften, and condition them curls. The first thing I noticed immediately is how it just glided. It was so smooth. It just felt like, I can't even explain it. Like the consistency is almost feeling like a jelly, you know, a jelly type of consistency. But it just went on so nice and I was easily able to detangle my hair without it using any tools, any struggle. It immediately made my curls pop like they were popping literally popping and they gave elongation which i can appreciate because y'all know how natural hair is it's a little on the funny side it shrinks when it wants to depending on what products you use and what techniques you use but baby the length was lengthening and i i was here for it i absolutely loved it the smell was really nice and it just gave that smooth nice you can just tell that this wash day is going to be a, a success and sometimes for me i dread because it depends on like how i apply or what products i use it's almost like a hit or miss when we do a wash and go but i have faith that this is going to be a bomb wash and go because you can see already how smooth the product goes on and how well the product is absorbing into my strands and just to think I was going to add a leave-in conditioner before this, you don't need that because it's a cream and a gel mixed in one. Okay, so that means that the styling process is cut in half because now you don't have to go back and add your second product. So what I'm going to do right now, because you guys know if you've been here for a while, I'm going to put my hair up in my little sloppy bun. We're going to let it air dry and then I'm going to come back and we're going to talk about this. I'm going to give my full thoughts on Rihanna's Fenty Hair Care line. This is how my hair turned out. The only reason why I pinned it up is because it was super super hot i just didn't want all my hair in my face but i don't even know where to begin i love the way my hair feels i love the way my hair smells when rihanna said that she wanted something that was gonna smell really good like her main goal was like the fragrance she wasn't kidding i promise you i've gotten so many compliments since i've been out baby it's fancy hair every move every motion you're gonna smell it it's gonna hit you in your nose although it's a smell that you know resonates it's not something that's gonna give you a headache well that's just my opinion let's just get into a recap of the three products that I did purchase my initial thoughts of the ritual and moisture repair shampoo if I had to rate it I would definitely rate it a 7 out of 10 and the only reason I'm gonna give it a 7 and not a 10 like I want to is because I felt like it was drying to my hair the beginning was just amazing like the smell the lather the consistency it gives everything but I did feel like for my hair, I didn't get as much moisture. I felt like I lost moisture. That's the only reason. But I'm going to give it another try and I'll probably add maybe some honey to it. Something, add a humectant, something to make it not dry my hair out. Because when you apply it, it feels, it gives a really good feel. And my scalp felt super clean. When it comes to the Ritual Moisture Repair Conditioner, I'm going to give this a 9.5. Absolutely love this. Again, the smell is beautiful. Love how thick it was. Amazing slip. I didn't struggle with detangling my hair. I didn't lose a lot of hair. It just felt really good on my hair. My hair felt like it was really nourished and I was getting all the goods. And last but not least, when it comes to this fancy hair, the home curl, curl defining cream, this is the one. This one, if you don't buy anything else from her line, I promise you this one is gonna do it. I am a product junkie. I've tried every, almost every styler, cream, gel, when it comes to my natural hair. You know, just trying to figure out what my hair likes and what it doesn't. I never heard of a gel cream and baby. When I tell you the feeling of my hair right now, like y'all don't even understand. The camera does no justice. I wish you could just feel my hair feels literally lightweight. It's super lightweight, but I have hold. 
So I can just go around and move and shake and I'm not gonna get no frizz. Frizz where? I'm gonna give this curl and jelly 10. This is a solid 10. I, amazing, superb. Felt like I was getting a treatment in my hair. Like your hair will literally feel super soft. It's, it's gonna give what it's supposed to give. I know we all have different textures and stuff, but if you have anything similar to mine, low porosity, get you that. It's a two in one and that's what I love because I don't really like to spend too long when it comes to doing my hair. So that gave what it's supposed to give and you get pulled for the day. This will probably give you a bomb twist out or a bomb braid out. I'm telling you because the definition that it created instantly, she took her time with this. Overall, I think this is a great line. Everybody's entitled to their opinions. I'm not here to be negative. I know some people just, they just want to find something wrong because they feel like celebrities just don't need to have a hair care line. But I'm going to always be real with you. There's nothing bad that I need to say. And again, she has eight products. I wasn't expecting every single product, at least that I even tried out of the three, to be perfect for me, honestly. You know what I mean? And that's what she said. Not every product is going to work for everybody, but there's going to be a product for, for someone. I'm super pleased with my results. This half up, half down is eaten all the way down. Don't play with me. I love when my hair smells good and it looks good. The only thing that I will say, and don't come for me, I'm just being real. I think that the price prices are a little bit steep. I can understand to a certain extent because when you are giving good quality, then of course you're gonna have to like increase the price. But I just feel like some people are not fortunate enough to be able to experience or try it because they don't have the funds. So the only thing I would say is just you know we can dumb the prices down just a little bit, make them a little, make them a little bit more affordable for for everybody. But let me know down below if you guys tried it or. If you're even gonna try it and if you did try it how'd you like it what was your favorite product from her line love you guys so much and i'll see you in my next upload simply share simply